here's what I did. The, he, his filmography is so huge that so I good. wanted to um, isolate. So like we just what I said a few minutes ago about his imperial period, 1982-ish through 1999. That's his like greatest period. So I went, I tried to choose the worst movie during that period. Okay. Um, just to kind of narrow it and, and, and it, it's so stark like a bad movie during that period is very stark <clears> and it <throat> sticks out because of such good work he did his movies are so good during that period i'm intrigued largely so so mine is a uh, 1997 um comic book film directed by joel schumacher batman okay. and robin i fucking hate this movie <laughs> <laughs> is that not the best one Oh, it's <laughs> so bad, dude. <laughs> yeah. And now he's not the star of the movie, but obviously he plays like a pretty, you know, important role in it. I he, I just jot down some things I hate about it. Okay, all the puns about freezing. So yeah. like when he says like, I'm afraid that my condition has left me cold to your pleas of mercy, he says to like, <laughs> to Batman, he says, you're not sending me to the cooler. What killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age. Let's kick some ice. Like, come a fuck on. And then the inane fucking musical score. It yeah. just the swelling music during these, like, nothing's happening. It's just like, what are you doing? Like, how, how are you deploying this? The score itself is not terrible. It's just like how, how it's used is awful. Uh, uninspired action and fight scenes, just so pathetic. Um, in one, like, an early one where uh, Dr. Freeze's henchmen use hockey sticks as weapons. And they're using the diamond as, as like a hockey puck. And then, and then somehow the uh, Batman and Robin both have ice skates in their boots. Like <laughs> so bad. And, but wait, what makes it the worst, I think is like the terrible acting. Mm -hmm. Uma Thurman, I think takes the cake as being just egregiously bad in this movie. And I, here's what I think, it, like this is before, obviously before the MCU where people are taking, you know, comic book movies more seriously. It's almost as if they were, mocking the source material you know uh, in their acting it's like if if you want to critique if you want to critique the source material do it in an, in an artful way in a thoughtful way don't just like make your acting terrible to like mimic the word bubbles in a bad comic book i oh i was so I, I, appalled and then there's bane who doesn't do anything except growl and like flexes his biceps <laughs> and, and 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 so there's that like over overacting and just like parody acting as contrasted with George Clooney who clearly didn't even want to be there I mean his he's so like he has no charisma whatsoever and then there's like the weird shit about the suit like Batman has nipples on his suit the, Robin has a cod piece I, I even saw one scene cards. where it looked like yeah I, so bad I saw one scene where it looked like Alicia Silverstone had a fucking nipples on her suit <laughs> so weird do you know what Charles think, Schumacher said when he submitted the first script? No. He says, and this, with some irony, I don't know why it has to be so serious. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and then Michael Keaton saw it and then just walked out because he was assigned to the film, but he, he, read, he read the script once and then said, <laughs> no fucking way. <laughs> no way, dude. And just yeah. like some of the, just like a couple more things. One, the, the, just like the plot points are so bad. Like when they're in the prison and, and uh, freeze, um, freezes the pipes to like blow out the, the apparently steel and reinforced wall. It's like, in what universe does that happen? Freezing pipes, blowing out a wall. Um, and then, okay, so even though Batman and Robin have, have, have been affected by poison ivy's pheromones, they let her do it again, like without any, <laughs> like, have you not seen this? They should try this. She did this to you just like 20 minutes ago. Um, and then when she actually kisses Robin and he pulls off the rubber lips, it's just like so bad. She oh, should have just, ki just kissed him again then to take to, to yeah. the fucking lesson. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh. And then oh. finally, finally at the end when, um, when Freeze like has a change of heart and he's like, and Clooney's like, yo, um, can you save Alfred? And he just opens up his suit and has like two little vials that apparently is a cure to this ravaging disease. It's just like, fuck off. I hate it. I think you had steam coming out of your ears then, Tim. <laughs> it's so you, went, terrible. You, you went bright red and there was steam coming out of your ears. Are you okay uh, now? Do you feel yeah, better? I'm, I'm, I, I feel like, like you feel I'm, better. 
I, 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 it's good to get it out. I feel very cathartic, but I, my hatred for this movie is like complete. Do you think yeah. you hate it because it's a comic book movie, though? Or just um, because... there's it's probably bad, something to that. Bad. There's got to be it's something bad. to that. Yeah, yeah. it's because I love comics, and I was just so offended by it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I have. I, I could, don't know if I could add to that. To be honest with you, it was uh, an all-encompassing <laughs> tirade. I, I, I was impressed. <laughs> I, enjo- I, en- I enjoyed it, and I was both scared. A lot like one of my ex-girlfriend's lovemaking techniques. <laughs> 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 I like oh. it. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> no go on, don't <laughs> who told you to stop? <laughs> yeah. Well, I passionately hate this, so I'm, I'm yeah, glad to get yeah. it out there. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what she was like. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, just one thing. Um when they were actually before they'd even finalized the script, they had meetings with toy companies to uh, see of course. what they to add in yeah, yeah. so yeah. Half, of, half of the gimmicks were actually added in genuinely just to sell toys so i, I was watching bad. something about it yeah it's uh, it's pretty bad i think everyone who was in that movie I mean, Clooney just doesn't want to talk about it he's like so embarrassed by it i i don't know what other and schumacher i think just issued an apology not just yeah. but he had he had issued an apology for it i don't know what uma thurman thinks the movie or um Frankly, what Arnold thinks of the movie, I can't imagine he thinks it's good. Did you notice the costume change just before the end as well? Like out of nowhere, they've all got silver trim. Oh yeah. no, I didn't that notice was, that. That was yeah, that was, yeah. the, that was the thing they they requested an additional costume change just to sell toys. Ugh. That just grosses me out even more. I had so much fun <laughs> watching all these crappy movies, but yeah, but it's... I feel like I feel like you knew you were zoned in on this. Like as soon as we suggested the topic, you you just knew you were like, finally, finally, yeah. I, finally, I get it. Finally, I get yeah. to do this. Finally, well, I, I did... get to be Tim unbridled. <laughs> well, I did rewatch it just to make sure that in fact it's as bad as I remember, and it's it's actually worse than I remember. The thing is, though, I would recommend it. I would send everyone to see it because it's so bad. It's just like watching a complete train wreck. 